The Great Eagle, an unmanned aerial system, has been a vital tool in patrolling the skies of Operation New Dawn in Iraq since 2010. Now for the first time in theater, it is being tested to deploy Hellfire missiles, a surface-to-air missile with multi-target precision strike capabilities. Because we've gone through a lot of training to get to this point, to be able to shoot the live Hellfires and not just utilize our house mouse for training exercises. So we're, we're excited and can't wait till this is finalized so we can start employing NASA as it should be. The importance of this s fire is the fact that it's the first time it's been done in this country by enlisted from this platform. It adds to the mission that the fact that we can now engage targets. Uh, you know, if we've got ground, ground guys pinned down, we can find out where they're getting shot from and get them unpinned. We were doing it to show the capabilities of the platform to actually engage targets on the ground to better support the ground troops. I was, I was lazing the target on the LMTBs so that when the, when the Hellfire left the rails, it would follow my laser spot and hit the target. It was exciting. We hit the target, destroyed it, did our job. With the successful test of the Hellfire missile, this now strengthens the ground commander's confidence that they will have one more asset to employ in the fight against terror. Reporting from Camp Taji, Iraq, I'm Army Staff Sergeant Yvonne Nehera.